What is up my friends? Welcome back. Today is the day we are doing gift guides. I am so excited to go through my Amazon top picks gift guides. I'm going to try and go through a couple different categories. So depending on who you're shopping for, this video should be helpful for you. I'm actually just going to have my gift guides pulled up here on my phone. They are all on my Amazon storefront. Everything will be linked below for you. But if you just head to my storefront, I have an entire curation for gift guides for her, for him, for parents, in-laws, for kiddos, and then a couple of more like specific categories like for the active girly, for the beauty lover, etc. So today we're gonna go through not all of them, but I handpicked some of my like all-time favorites from a bunch of different categories. We're gonna go through them today. So grab a coffee, grab a hot cocoa, grab something cozy. I have my cozy Amazon sweater on that I'm obsessed with. I have my long sleeve, super soft shirt that I'm obsessed with. So yeah, grab a snack, snack grab a drink. Let's jump in. Okay, so I wanna get some pricier items out of the way first. I'm gonna start with for her because these are all things that I either own or would absolutely die to get. The first thing I want to pop up is the YSL white card holder. If you didn't know, if you want to do like a splurgy big gift for someone or you want to send this link to someone for yourself, Amazon has luxury goods. So they're not like secondhand, they are just like YSL has an Amazon store and you can get real authentic designer goods on Amazon now, which is so, so crazy. So this wallet holder, my boy, my boyfriend, ooh. But only been married for six years. <laughs> that was very odd. I think I was thinking about like if you guys have boyfriends. My husband got me this for my birthday last year and I am obsessed with it. I have always had like a really messy wallet. It's kind of a disaster. So when I got this, it was amazing. It just streamlined everything. I just have my ID, two cards done. It fits in everything. It's so cute and little. The white goes with every purse that you may possibly own. I just move it from bag to bag depending on, you know, what I'm wearing that day. But it's gorgeous. It speaks for itself. That would be a big splurge item, but obviously an incredible gift. The other one I want to mention that's YSL, or we'll just probably like say this as a group is the sunglasses. You guys know I'm like an absolute sunglass junkie. So these YSLs that I, that I got on Amazon and the Prada sunglasses, those would all be incredible gifts for someone, someone very lucky. Okay. Moving away from designery, designery, Sure, we're making up words. Let's move into like essentials and things that like I wear and use constantly. I have to, have to, have to include the Butterlux Sears Yoga leggings, okay? If you don't own them yet, put them on your list. If you know an active girly or someone who just loves to live in leggings or there's like a pregnant person in your life, these would be an incredible gift. I wear them, I'm not kidding you, every single day. They're that comfortable. Also, when my bump gets bigger, they also have a maternity pair. So I will 100% be getting those because they're the exact same fabric. Oh my God, they're just so comfortable. I love also the length on them because I'm short and a lot of times leggings like go under my heel and I hate that. So these are, okay, yeah, so the ones that I do are the 25 inch and those are perfect. Like they hit me right at my ankle, exactly what I need. Um, I have them in multiple colors, black, right? I'm literally wearing them right now. This color, um, I have a green. You can't go wrong, any color, any size. I mean, they're just so amazing. So those are a must have, okay? Everyone should own those. What could be a cute little like active girly gift would be like, uh, and I have a graphic for this, I'll pop up, but could be like a butter lux legging, a little like long sleeve zip up. And then maybe like, if you wanted to add something like more expensive in like a pair of headphones or like a nice pair of sneakers. I have a ton of different ideas like that in there. If there is like an active girly or a girly who's trying to just like get on her workout grind, especially in the new year, all the CRZ yoga stuff I have is amazing. Like you really can't go wrong for sneakers. I have to mention these on cloud. Are they called on cloud? I never really know what they're called. I own them, but I found these white slash sand, this style that is so gorgeous. I'm like, oh my God, I need those. Cause I have the all white, but this colorway is like screaming my name. And these are the most comfortable sneakers I own. These are sneakers that you will wear to travel anywhere you're going in an airport. You will wear them walking on vacation if you're having like an excursion day. You will wear them out on walks. You will wear them to work out. I mean, they are the best, most comfortable sneakers I own. I own a lot of pairs. These are the ones I constantly grab for. They're the most loved, like torn up, like need to go in the wash. They are so good. They are a pricey item. 
that's why they're on the gift guide, okay? We're gonna send them to someone who wants to be really nice to us this holiday season, and we're gonna say, we need those ones. Or you're gonna be really nice to someone and make their day. Okay, let's talk cozy. You guys know, normally, and even when I'm not pregnant, I'm obsessed with just like cozy, soft things, like things like this. I just never not want to feel cozy and comfortable, especially when it's winter. It's just like, ugh. all you want is like a cozy blanket, cozy scarf, shirt, whatever. This Barefoot Dreams robe has been on my list for multiple years. I don't know how hard I need to drop the hint <laughs> to Ethan for, for him to get me this. <laughs> I'm gonna probably just send him some links. It's an expensive robe, so I've not like really been like, eh, like does it make sense? It's a robe. But you guys, I have Barefoot Dreams blankets. I, ha I got one for Logan when he was little. I have one of my own. The robe is the same material. Their material is just unmatched. If you want like that cozy winter mm, robe, the Barefoot Dreams robe. And that would be an incredible gift, of course. I also have a more budget-friendly option. This one is so, so cute. It's that like fruit pattern that we're seeing everywhere because I believe they're a lookalike or a more pricey item. That's like the way I have to say it. Um, but it's so cute. It's fleece, so it will be cozy, um, but it has these cute little berries on it and it's just really freaking cute. That's also on my list. But I'm like, how many robes can one girl have? Like, when is it too many robes? I literally just gave like three away. I just donated three robes. Barefoot Dreams blanket would also be amazing. I just love a cozy blanket. Or if you know someone who recently purchased a house, need like a house, nice housewarming gift, like a cozy blanket that they can snuggle up on their new couch in their new house with a bottle of wine and maybe like, a, I don't know, a nice candle. There you go. That could even be like a little holiday gift for anyone, any like any person who wants to like kind of like cozy up their home a little bit. Okay, some self-care options. The Skinny Confidential Ice Roller is an unmatched ice roller. Okay, now there, I own other Amazon ice rollers. They're fine. This one takes it to the next level. If you follow um, Lauren, Lauren Bostick, she is the Skinny Confidential you know all the like hard work and research and everything that went into creating this ice roller and it is unmatched okay it's titanium so it stays cold even if you don't put it in the fridge so i literally just leave it next to my bed and in the morning when i wake up i roll it depuffs it gets lymphatic drainage going i mean rolling your face is just so 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 like nice and cleansing in the morning it feels so good it makes your face look so much more chiseled i admittedly did not do it today and i feel puffy to be honest so that would be an amazing gift. Again, that's a pricier ice roller. You could definitely find a cheaper option and I have a couple linked, but that's a really good one. And then the PMD facial, I don't know, it's a microderm cleansing device. I've been raving about this device for so long and I want all of my friends to have it because it's one of those things that everyone can use because it's just a way to deep clean your face. It has helped me with my texture that I always get on my jaw and especially now that I'm pregnant, like the texture is out of control because these hormones. So I actually use it every single time I get in the shower. I do my like really sudsy cleanser. I put that on my face with my hands and then I grab my PMD and I turn it all the way up and I just massage the shit out of my face and jaw. And it just really gets in deep. Like you can feel the difference after you use it than just washing your face with your hands. It's one of those things like I believe every single person should use because washing your face with your hands just does not do it. Fine for like every other day, but like when you really want to deep clean, you need something like this. And this has been by far my favorite. I've tried so many of these devices. Okay, speaking of devices, let's talk about a new face because I feel like people are always like, oh, like, is that actually work? Like, can I get a review of that? I always get questions about it. It's on my gift guide every single year for a reason. It is such a good device. The difference that it makes your, the difference in how your face looks, sorry, my scarf is falling off me a bit because I'm talking with so much passion the difference that you will see in your face after using that device is honestly insane both immediately and long term i can't use it right now because i don't believe it's pregnancy safe like the microcurrent so i i would show it to you i actually think i have a video on my youtube channel i do where i used it and we compared one side of my face to the other and you guys one side is so lifted after using it like you would not believe so when you use it over 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 time like months you're gonna see that change long term thing is amazing you just have to be consistent with it if you use it once yeah you'll see a difference once and then it'll go away but like if you're consistent with it 
you will love it. Also, any beauty lover, you know, beauty device lover in your life will be obsessed with that and may already own that. Okay, I also have to mention the Grande Cosmetics little gift sets. I feel like these are so cute and they're, they're a very easy gift for any beauty lover in your life. So this set specifically, I think comes with a brow serum, a lash serum, and their, um, what is this? Their mascara, their peptide mascara. Own and love all three of them. But if you just wanna take your brows and your lashes to the next level, these are an incredible, incredible investment. And they're not too much, like this whole kit is, is like less than a hundred bucks. It's those three products. Those are gonna last you like three months at least, each bottle. So that's gonna last you forever. You're gonna love those, they work, trust me. Okay, another fun gift. This might be out of the ordinary, but if you know someone who like loves taking photos or wants to like, build a memory book or especially a pregnant person, this is an amazing gift idea for them. The Instax Mini Link printer. So basically you can print photos from your iPhone directly to the printer and they come out like little Polaroids. I bought it for my pregnancy to get bump pics. I'm obsessed with it. When I was pregnant with Logan, my first child, I used an actual like Instax camera. And to be honest, those are very temperamental. Mine died and you it's really hard to like, get a good shot because you're looking through a hole. It's very like medieval, <laughs> you know what I mean? This is the best. So what I do for when I use this, I literally just take a video, like a high res 4K video on my phone of my bum or whatever it is that I want a picture of. Then I go back and screenshot and then I send it to the app and that app just, I'm choking. <clears throat> and that app just prints it out right there, or the, the printer. Wow, you send it to the app at the, through the app, it comes out the printer and you just get this cute little Polaroid. So I'll pop up what I did for mine. I have a little picture of all the Polaroids I got of my bump last week and I'm obsessed with that. I'm gonna do it every week. You can get much nicer photos than just using a camera. It's more expensive than the camera, but again, the camera is kind of temperamental. You don't get as good of shots. And like I said, mine broke, so. Okay, if you know anyone with AirPods, an amazing gift is these, these um, silicone covers. Because if you wear makeup and you put your Air Max is on, your makeup gets all over those things. And you can take those pads off and clean them, but if you just get the covers, you don't have to. So these are like really cool covers that just snap on to your AirPod Maxes. That I feel like is a nice affordable gift for someone to like upgrade someone's something that is already like pretty expensive. Okay, another fun idea is a little towel warmer. This could be a really good idea for like a mother-in-law or your mom or literally anyone because who would not enjoy a towel warmer? This one's about a hundred bucks. You put it, you put your towel in like before the shower and you, there's a little timer, turn it on. When you get out of the shower, your towel is warm. I mean, talk about luxury. That is just heaven to me. Little things like that, I really feel like upgrade your life. Like if you do a, like 10 little things like that a day, your whole day in life is just gonna feel better. <laughs> in my opinion. Those are the things I like to spend money on because they just like really elevate. Speaking of things like that, I would say an espresso is a really nice gift. I just feel like a lot of people have them by now, but maybe for like a parent who makes like pot coffee and maybe you wanna like upgrade them a little bit or make it easier for them to make a pot of coffee, a little a, a, or a nice Nespresso with the little pods and then maybe like a couple pod um, like refills would be a really nice gift. Okay, also through here, I have fashion stuff. You guys gotta know all stuff I love, like the UGG women's Taz braid slipper. I feel like those are gonna be a huge item this year. You can't go wrong with any UGG slipper or any fuzzy slipper for that matter. I have a couple candles listed here, which again, easy to bundle with other things or just a nice gift for like a coworker. You know what I mean? Like just nice candles, like a $30 candle instead of like a $5 candle. Just like a little bit nicer. Okay, for the person who loves wine in your life, you need to get them this. It is so good. My friend got it for me when we moved into our house and I, it's the only thing I use to open wine anymore. It's this cork pop bottle opener. So it has these little refillable like canisters. I have not even switched wine yet and I've lived here for over a year and I drink a lot of wine, okay? I just got pregnant, so I just stopped drinking wine. But basically you just like shove, there's like a needle and it shove it into the bottle and then you press the top and somehow it like pushes the cork up and pops it up. It's almost like a champagne bottle popping. It's the easiest way and it's like really fun, honestly, to get a wine cork out. I'm obsessed with it. Again, it's just like a fun gift that's like the person will use, you know they will use it if they drink wine because I'm telling you that's how it's awesome. I don't use anything else. You just have like the little rabbit, sucks. This thing's awesome. And like I said, it comes with a refill and I have not refilled it. So 
it's like I feel like when people hear refills they get a little like and eh, I don't want to have to buy something that's like you probably won't for multiple years so don't stress about that you could also do like a little sorry I'm always winded when I do these videos but also because I'm pregnant you could also do like a nice bottle of wine that and like a decanter for like a little wine bundle if you wanted to like level it up i love putting like little things together and making little like basket type things for someone based on what they like i feel like that makes it a lot easier to think about what to get them all right let's move on to men because i do feel that they are the hardest to shop for much harder than us we're very easy okay so headphones ethan is obsessed these are all ethan approved ethan owns a lot of these if not i literally said go through amazon and like make your Christmas list and send it to me. And I added everything to this list. So that's where a lot of these come from. The Beat Studio Pro wireless headphones, he loves them. They're awesome and they're they're $2.99, so they're expensive, but they're not like $500 like the Air Maxes. If you wanted to do a little splurge, but not an, an insane splurge, those are a great option. He also really wants this JBL speaker. Um, I have a couple on here and Friends of mine own these and they're all obsessed with them. Ethan's like, yeah, we need to get like a bunch of those for around the house. So I feel like a speaker is a really good gift for a man because you know, you could have like a little portable one that he could take outside if he's doing yard work or one for like out, you know, in the porch, if it's like nice out, we're hanging out out there or one just like for the kitchen while we're cooking dinner. Like speakers around the house are very nice. They add a lot of ambiance and I think that's like a fun gift for a guy. I feel like every man needs a new wallet. Do you not feel that? Like I feel that every man's wallet is just an absolute disaster disaster so i found two really basic ones on here i honestly bought ethan a wallet a couple years ago and he just never used it like never switched out like liked his more and i was like your wallet is literally horrible and it's thick i'm like you're not it's like there's like studies where you're not supposed to have a thick wallet and keep it in your back pocket when you sit down it messes up your back i'm like can you just use the wallet i got you but anyway i have a couple really nice just like plain black ones here one more expensive one more affordable so pick your poison an apple air tag would be great for a man if he is traveling a lot on business whatever family trips whatever really nice to have those and this is obviously for anyone but really nice to be able to throw those in your bags when you're traveling so you can follow and track your bags those are great okay the shoes in here do i have the kohan shoes i really hope i do these kohan shoes that i have on here are so freaking cute and nice and i'm like oh my god i feel like every man needs these they're just a very nice shoe they're like in between like a sneaker and a dress shoe which i feel like is a good to have for like a dinner where you don't want them wearing like sneaker sneakers but you also don't need a dress shoe like something right in between i feel like those are very nice the ugg slippers he's obsessed with the tasman and the ascot he has both of them he loves them both equally i would say if you're gonna choose one over the other it depends on your man I can't, I can't make that decision for you. I can only just give you the options. He added all of these hats. The melon hat is so good. Again, it's on my gift guide every year. He loves it. It's waterproof, like sweat proof. It looks really good on him. Like the shape of it. I'm like, I like that hat. You know how some hats are like, I don't know. They just like don't look that good on their head. <laughs> this one looks very good on his head. I really like it. And then he also loved this Mizuno mesh hat, which I think is a golf hat. So I'm like, okay, I know exactly what I'm getting you this year. I'm like, okay. Then I have a couple other just like basics in terms of like workout clothes or just like everyday essentials. He owns most of these, like these Amazon shirts, all the CRZ yoga stuff is so good for any guy in your life that works out. A nice CRZ yoga shirt, like t-shirt or long sleeve, all so good. Also their pants, their joggers, Ethan's obsessed with them and their golf pants if you got a golf man in your life. I also feel a watch is like a very classic gift for a man on the in the holidays, but like a good gift. Like I don't feel like... They're ever like, oh, I wish you didn't get me a watch. You know what I mean? If you got like a nice watch, um, I was gonna get, I was thinking about getting him like a like a more like special occasion watch, but he added on a couple like more everyday watches here, which does make more sense for him. So this Belova one is so nice. I really love the black with the gold. I feel like that would look really good on him, but I, and I also feel like you could dress that one up, which is nice. And then Yetis. I feel like anything from Yeti, a man is gonna be happy with. Ethan is obsessed like it's like a it's like the Stanley thing for girls. Like I feel like guys are obsessed with Yeti. The cup with the handle is the one he uses every single day. He has multiples, but he also has the mug, which is just like an insulated nice coffee mug. And then this portable cooler is like a more 
like a smaller version of their big one if you don't want to like splurge and get the huge one because those ones are really expensive and they're enormous that's like an enormous gift the little portable one is great for summer just to like bring to the beach if you don't need if you know if you don't need like a huge cooler i've also gotten him this whiskey decanter and glass set we still have it out he loves it he like got into whiskey over the last couple of years so like being able to pour in like a nice bottle of whiskey into the decanter and have the matching glasses that's like a fun thing for him and then the um the little whiskey what are they called oh like you can do the whiskey rocks if they don't like um like actual ice but if they do like ice ethan really likes to make like the big ball that really slowly melts it's a whiskey thing so that is also like a cute gift if you want to do like a whiskey bottle in those or the decanter set i feel like you have options okay the theragun oh my god that thing is so good this could obviously be for anyone but ethan like he likes to use it after he works out like on his leg muscles i've noticed like since i've gotten pregnant my back is getting really tight so i started using it like on my butt and down my leg to like relieve some of the like sciatic whatever i'm getting i sound 95. that thing is life-changing okay i was like barely able to walk the other day because everything was like so tight i don't know if i slept weird or what or like my ligaments are just stretching because i'm pregnant but i use that and like massage for like maybe 10 minutes on like my IT band, my butt and like down my leg and it just released all the tightness. I could stand up, walk, I felt like a new person. So that is a really good gift for anyone who's like super active or anyone who just like might want like a nice massager. Thing works wonders. Okay, so I have a whole list here for parents. I won't go through every single one, but I have a lot of different coffee favorites. I have wine favorites, candles. Remember, think of just like bundling a couple things together. If you, I always feel like, when I buy one thing, I'm like, is that a weird gift? Like, is it weird to buy someone a blanket? But then if I add like one other thing with it, I'm like, ooh, it's a whole, it's a whole thing. Do you know what I mean? Is that stupid? Is that excessive? I don't know. But that makes me feel better about the gift. I'm weird that way. The other really great thing for in-laws or parents, if you are a parent yourself and they have grandkids, this NYX Play digital picture frame, both my parents and my in-laws are obsessed with theirs. We upload photos to them all the time and that way they don't have to like ask us for pictures. They get the photos right to them, you know, and they can see them. It's like a nice surprise every day. If you send them over every week, they're like, oh, I haven't seen that picture yet. It's a really good gift. And then for kiddos, really quick, if you have babies or toddlers, I have a full list of like toys, puzzles, bigger things, also clothes. All, honestly, all of this stuff is so good. I won't talk too much about it because I do feel like these are really specific to like the age of kid that you're shopping for, but we own a lot of these. If not, I've bought these now for Logan for Christmas. They're all really good gifts. I think if you have any kid in your life that you're shopping for, you're gonna like this list. Let me see if I can come up with like one or two call outs. These Water Wow Water Reveal Pads. Logan's obsessed with these. He literally sits there and just colors with them all day long. They're no mess. You literally put water in the pen and you open up. It's perfect for that age too because they can't quite color yet. Like, like he's starting to color with crayons and stuff, but if you have like a new two year old, or even a little bit younger. It's awesome because they just, the water comes out of the pen and they color it and it's like they're coloring a picture, but it's just like the water reveals the whole photo. So he sits there for a long, like when we first got these, he was sitting there for a long time doing this. There's a little three pack bundle, which is amazing. Anything Melissa and Doug, they're probably like my favorite kid brand of stuff from toys to puzzles to like coloring, things like that. They also have this awesome, if you want something bigger, they have this awesome Montessori indoor playhouse. I'm considering getting this for Logan, but it's basically like this big tent and there's a little table and there's like shelves and games on the side to put in his playroom. So he has somewhere to like sit down and play that's like kind of his. It's not just like a, a blank room. I'm trying to figure out if it's gonna fit in the playroom, but I feel like that would be a really nice big gift or just like a crafts table for him to them to sit at. I've noticed that like, he definitely wants to like either be up on the island with us or up at the table with us. And like, it's just so, so high for him. So him having his own table down low is really nice. I also put like a bath bomb in here, some bath toys, our favorite hooded towel. Again, these could be more things for like a parent, but this hooded towel is so freaking cute. He, we put it on after his bath every night and it's so convenient because you're not like using a regular adult towel like trying to dry him off. You just put it on, the hood goes on. We like dry his hair with the hood, dry the rest of his body, just like pat the towel and he loves it. We call it his burrito blanket or his burrito towel. We're like, are you ready to be a burrito and get out of the bath? Let's wrap you up like a burrito. It's just ridiculous stuff, you know? Um, all the Barefoot Dream stuff is so good for kids or babies or like moms to be. This skip hop table, this is the last thing I talk about. It's the thing we have used the longest. 
we probably got it for him when he was six months old and he is still using it and he's two, almost two and a half. So that's two years of use. Like, and if you know kids, like usually it's 15 minutes and they're done with it. Like the fact that we've gotten two years of use out of this is amazing. The cool thing is that it starts when they're really little. So if they're not standing or walking it, you can put them in there and it's like a little seat for them and they have all the stuff around them to play with. And then they can stand on the little ledge underneath if they're not too tall and you can kind of move the ledge down as they grow until finally getting rid of that. And then once they're big enough and they're walking and stuff, you take that little part on the bottom and you stick it on the top. And then they have a little table and that's how he's been using it. So he has his like crayons all around there. It's like a little table and he colors. So I'm like, that is just one of those things where it's like, you have to buy a parent something that you know their kid or that you don't know if their kid is gonna use for a long time. That is something we have used forever. Okay, I feel like I could continue talking for about six more hours. So we're gonna stop. I hope that wasn't too much and that wasn't too overwhelming. Like I said, everything is bundled up and listed out and should be super easy for you guys to shop on my storefront. I'll link all those lists and graphics and stuff below for you guys. If you need any other ideas or you want another gift guide video, if you want me to talk through more ideas or like specifics, that I didn't hit on, which I hopefully I hit on like most stuff. Let me know in the comment section. I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching and keep an eye on my other socials because Black Friday deals have already started on Amazon. They are from the 17th, I believe to the 27th of a 10 day Black Friday deal to Cyber Monday. Um, much longer than usual. I think it was only like five days last year. So they've doubled it in hopes that I think it's, it's like a little less overwhelming. You don't have such a short window to shop. Those are all live right now. Click the link underneath here and you can shop all the deals. And I'll be adding a bunch of those deals to my other socials so that you guys can check those out. Thank you so much for watching. I love you guys. I will see you in my next one.